Hey viewers, uh, when building up a bike wheel, you need to take various measurements to help determine the length of spokes that you need for building that wheel. Um, and one of those measurements is ERD, or effective rim diameter. And I made some high-tech fancy tools that help me measure the ERD of a rim. And I'm going to show you how I made those. And here are the high-tech fancy tools that I made. I call them ERD measuring thingies. They're made out of a couple old spokes. These were real simple to make. All I did was I took the nipples and actually glued them onto the threads and then cut the other end of the spoke down here so that it was exactly 300 millimeters here from the base of the nipple right here, this little underside of the nipple right here where it actually contacts the rim, down to the end of the spokes. It's exactly 300 millimeters. Okay, now to measure the ERD of a rim using these tools, what you're gonna do is you're going to insert the spoke into the uh, spoke hole here on one side of the rim and you go around the exact opposite side of the rim and insert the other tool uh, through there and make sure that the nipples are fully seated into the rim. Now knowing that each one of these spokes is exactly 300 millimeters uh, long from where it enters the rim that's a total of 600 millimeters. Now all I have to do is measure the distance between the ends of the two spokes here. So what I'm gonna do is use a ruler and set these on there like this and measure the distance between these and that looks like to be about three millimeters. So that would be 603 millimeters for the ERD of this rim. But I don't want to stop there. I actually want to take the measurement from a couple different angles as well because the rim might not be exactly round. And so if I get slightly varying uh, distances, then what I'll do is I'll take those distances and average them out. And that'll give me my effective rim diameter. Now, if you're, if you're measuring a smaller rim, um, what you do want to do then, because uh, the spokes will then overlap, measure the distance between the ends of the spokes this way and then subtract that distance from the 600. So if this measured out to be like 30 millimeters, I would subtract that from 600 and that would give me 570 millimeters uh, for the ERD. Anyway, hope you found this useful or interesting. If you did, please click like on my video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, click the big subscribe button. You'll see new videos that come out. I have a webpage, rjthebikeguy.com. Go over there. I have uh, forums where you can ask questions or comment on my videos. And I also have all my videos uh, over there categorized. It makes it a little easier to find for the topic you're looking for. And I'm also over on Facebook, RJ the Bike Guy. Go over there, like that page, and I post a lot of stuff over there as well. Anyway, thank you very much for watching.